Hi, George here. And Minecraft has done it again. They've now updated to version 121.3. And that means that they've also changed the pack format number and my packs no longer work. You can see it right back there. Let's just go back and take a look at that. There we go. This is my giant 100,000 play button right there. I don't have the 100,000 subscribers yet, but it's nice to have something to dream about. And that's what that's supposed to be. It's all made up of paintings and I have the paintings changed for the resource pack. So let's go ahead and fix this and get this working again. And for that, we need to get into the resource pack. So hit the escape key, go into options and resource packs. There's how all my packs are now showing red. It means that none of these are working. Now, what I'll be showing you here is going to work for simple packs. If there's some fancy programming in the pack, this might not work. It depends upon the pack, but it's worth a try anyway. And if I come down here to one that just says HTG custom nine, that's my basic pack in there with all my good stuff in it. So let's open the pack folder. And that's that one right here. Now, if you have your pack zipped, which I normally do to save space like this, you'll have to unzip the pack. But let's just get this copied over to a new folder and I have my working folder right here. So I'm just gonna take this one. Let's open this up. All I need in here is that pack MC meta file. Now, since this is not zipped, I can fix it right over here. But in case yours is zipped, what you would do is you would take your zipped file, drag it over here. I'm going to copy, unzip, right, extract all in the same place, extract, go in here, and then change the pack MC meta right here. Let's just go ahead and open this one up. Now I do this inside of Notepad++. It's a free download. And where it says pack format, this is now changed to pack format 42. And we'll save that, get that closed down. That's now good. Now you can't go back here and then zip this up. That's gonna mess things up. You have to zip what's inside of that. So grab all those, right click and compress to zip file. I'll call it Polka Squares 2 so it doesn't get messed up. And I'll right drag it over here and move here. So that one's done. I can now delete this one, hit the delete key. So that's been fixed. Now in here, if you don't have your pack zipped, you can fix it right here inside of the resource packs folder. Open this up and there's the pack MC meta. Let's open this one up. Same thing, just change that pack format to 42 and save. And again, that's inside of Notepad++. And since it wasn't zipped, that's perfectly fine. That's okay. And it's all set to go. We can now close this down, this out of the way. I'll bring the game back up again. Notice so that now says that these are okay. So the red has gone away on those two. That's fine. So let's bring over our custom one here and it'll bring over the Polka squares as well. So we have these back in again, choose done. It should reload the packs and we should see the colors change. Here we go. That's my color selection that I have for my interface. Choose done again, back to game. And there we go. There's my play button all working again, just the way it should. Notice my name is not on that. Once I get past that 100,000 subscribers, I'll have my name on there and that'll be then great. I'll put in the name of the channel right there. Don't have those yet, so you can help me get that just by clicking on subscribe. That way you won't miss any videos in the future. Also, my polka dot squares are working again, so that's looking great. So there you go. If your packs stop working, that's the first thing I would try is to make sure that your pack format is up to date. And if you want to download the pack MC meta for that, I have it inside my website. I'll put a link for that in the description and I'll see you next time.